Hey guys, here's how to trick Farsh Mark. Stay tuned and I'll tell you all about it. Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Alina and I'm a part-time reseller on Poshmark. So somebody is asking you to overwrite your latest offer. And they're asking so nicely that you cannot just say no. But after you have made an offer, the client must either decline, take the offer or wait 24 hours in order to be able to take another action. So here is how to get around it and I will share my screen with you just to show you how to do it. If you enjoy this trick, please give me a thumbs up and if you're not already subscribed, please subscribe to my channel for more content. Upon sending an offer on a tunic top to this lovely customer, she asked me if I could pretty please offer a lower discount. So what to do in this case, because once an offer is sent, that's it for the next 24 hours, right? Well, this is how you go around it. Just add the item to a private bundle for your customer. Then go on and edit the sizing on that particular item and remove it from the bundle. You will still have it in the window, but it's going to be on the bottom. After you edit the item, you can re-add using the plus button. To change the size, go into the desired listing in your closet, click edit, go to size all the way on top, click custom size and spell out the desired size. Make sure it's the same size of the piece you are selling to avoid any confusions and open cases. Make sure to save it. When you return to the bundle to send your offer, you will notice it's asking you to select the size. Both you and the buyer will have to select the spelled out sizing in order for this to work. If it's still not working, you will have to copy the listing with spelled out sizing and re-add to the buyer's bundle and send the offer that way. If this is still not working, delete the listing entirely and create a completely new listing, add it to the buyer's bundle and send the offer that way. If you know what to do on your end, but the customer might not be that computer savvy and they don't know what to click, this might result in the offer not going through, so you will have to entirely create another listing with the same item. So try to communicate to your customer what they should do. Uh, in this case, I am commenting in the bundle and telling them to select the spelled out sizing in the listing and accept the offer when prompted. And here you see a few moments later, she accepted my offer. Thank you very much. I packed and shipped right away. I usually send a text within the listing uh, right after somebody is purchasing something, thanking them and uh, letting them know I will ship today or tomorrow. Please stay tuned for more tips and tricks on how to overwrite the system and how to make more sales on Poshmark. Full disclosure here, I am by no means an expert. I'm just trying to help people like me understand Poshmark and navigate easily just in case they want to start their own closet. And I strongly suggest you do your own research. 